morning. So I thought that today I would go ahead and do a little bit of a day in the life. So it is a little bit later. Usually I plan these things ahead of time. So I start filming right away when I wake up. But today I didn't know yet and I just decided. And it is 10.04. So I woke up at 7.30. I took a shower, said goodbye to Steve. Um, let Asher go outside, fed him, watched some YouTube, had some breakfast, <laughs> I don't know, all those types of things. And um, today is just going to be kind of a relaxed day. I'm going to be staying home most of the day. I have, I have to run out, which I just found out, but um, my plan is to just be at home, do a lot of cleaning, do some... Uh, holiday wrapping and I still have to make my surprise for our St. Nicholas Day celebration tomorrow so I have a lot of things going on and I thought today I can film them because this won't be up until after would you like my holiday nails I got I did them in silver for a party we had yesterday so yeah that is I figured I could film it because uh, it won't be up until after the people have already opened their presents so it won't matter so that is what is going on with me today. Um, the reason I need to run out in just a minute is because Steve, uh, I thought he was going to have lunch at work because usually when he goes to this one place he does, but it turns out he went back to the office already and it's only 10 so he's not having lunch with them. So I need I needed to make him lunch so I just packed him really quickly so just a sandwich and some cookies and chips and um a clementine and i just put it all in the thing so i'm gonna bring that to him i'll probably take asher with me and then maybe take him somewhere i don't know i'm gonna see if there's like a because there's parks near where Steve works but they're all downtown parks so they have a lot of people in them and um, I'd rather just take Asher to like a bigger, more nature -y place. So I don't know if I'm out, if I'll drive him somewhere, but I'll at least take him in the car so he can go on a car ride <laughs> and have something to do because he hates when I leave in the morning. And I've been doing that lately. So I thought I would at least take him in the car because all I have to do is drop it off. So it won't be like I'm leaving him in the car. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I might actually run to my parents' house because I need some things for my surprise, so I might do that. And then I can take Asher and then he can play there, I guess, for a little bit. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. So anyway, that is what I'm what I'm getting ready to do right now. I'm just um I just got myself ready and well for the most part I'm just I mean I'm dropping off lunch, it's not a big deal. So I'm gonna go ahead and um get everything and get loaded up and probably just go ahead and do that first thing. All right, so we are in the car. It is 10, 16, and we're gonna go drop off uh, Steve's lunch. But we decided that, and by we, I mean me and Asher, um, instead of going to my parents' house, we're just gonna drop off the lunch because I want to get stuff done today in the house because I've every day I end up like someone texts me and is like, hey, do you want to go to lunch? And I'm like, okay, or I have errands to run, or I don't know. I just, I end up leaving the house, and then that ends up taking until one or two in the afternoon, and then get home and I'm tired and I, I don't get much housework done. So I wanted to really have a day actually at home, especially since we have all these parties this week and we have a party tomorrow, and it's just, uh, and then next week is Christmas, and I just wanted to have a day that I can actually get stuff done. So we're just gonna run and bring the lunch and then come back home. So we're gonna go do that now. Right, buddy? Yep. Okay, crazy lighting. But I just remembered a park that I used to go to uh, with some kids I babysat for, and it, it isn't really a dog-friendly park, but it is directly on the way home from Steve's work so I thought we would just come here maybe like walk around for like 10 minutes it's very small but um it's a park and it's grass and trees and he'll sniff around and hopefully not do anything else because I did not bring any plastic bags so <laughs> I'm just gonna go and let him sniff and walk around and um 
you know, just to be fun for him, right, Ashy? But yeah, we dropped off Steve's lunch. Asher was very excited. So, <laughs> all right, we're gonna go in, uh, go over there really quick. We should be home before 11. It's only 10:35, so um, I figure this is fine. It's not gonna take that much out of our day. So we're gonna run and walk around a little bit. Hi, Asher. Did you have fun? <laughs> so happy, huh? All right, let's go home. We're home again. It's uh, 10.55. All right, I'm going to make some coffee. So this is low. So, some more water. Oh no! I have so much cleaning to do. All these dishes, all the dishes to unload. I have to clean the counters, the bathrooms, I have to do laundry, I have to wash the sheets. I just have so much. Oh, this is hard to do, guys. Oh no, I spilled water everywhere. Should not do that while filming. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just gonna have my breakfast blend and sit down for just a minute. See, it's only 10.53. That is great. And now it is 11.26 because I got very distracted. <laughs> But I drank my coffee and I'm ready to clean now. So I'm going to make a to-do list and so I will just get a lot done because today is really a day that I want to get a lot done. I might just, um, yeah, I'll just make a to-do list and then just work my way through the whole thing. <laughs> All right, let's get started. Let's go! I'm about to wash my sheets, so I just add some laundry soap. And then a little bit of bleach. I only really bleach for um for my sheets because they are white and makeup comes off on them and stuff like that but left to do is just um, wipe down the counters and um, actually I think I just want to clean up my lunchbox and then I'm gonna wipe down the counters and I'll be done with the kitchen all right I cleaned the um, the coffee area then there are the dishes I washed and I cleaned all of the counters and my stovetop and everything so looks a lot better so this is my I'll show you this. Some Amish friendship bread that I got from one of my friends. She's she's not Amish, but um, she got it from somebody. And um, pretty much what it is is you get this starter, which is just flour and milk and sugar. And um, you keep it for 10 days, and then you split it up into, you add more ingredients, and then you split it up into three parts, you give, or four parts, you give three parts to your friends, and you keep one and bake it into bread, and then the next people, whoever you gave it to, have to also keep it for 10 days and do the same, so I guess the bread keeps getting handed off and off to the next person, 
I have never done it, but um, it is really exciting. <laughs> I'm excited to see what it turns out looking like every day. It, ha it tells you what to do. It tells you like, wash the bag, wash the bag. Um, and then you add ingredients and things like that. So I'm looking forward to seeing what this turns out to. Um, right now I'm on day seven. Yeah, day seven. So should be pretty fun. Apparently the bread is really good because she already made hers. So, yep, that is what I'm doing with this bag. If you saw it and you're wondering what is that in the corner that she is keeping for some reason, it's my friendship bread. <laughs> the next thing I'm going to do is sort some books. <laughs> and we have this stack. And I think, wait. I think maybe that one too. This one. Um, that's all. Oh, wait, no, that one down there. These four, and then there's a fifth one back there that are all boxes of books that need to be sorted through. So I'm not really looking forward to this, but I don't want to have an empty bookshelf sitting there because that just says we just moved in and we haven't taken the time to go through these any yet. So anyway, I'm gonna get started. Hopefully the first box I open will be full of great books that I could just put in the front room. <laughs> now we'll see. All right, that took a while picking out the books that I wanted, but I picked out just some fun books and um, some books that I might want to read at some point. And I just put them all on the bottom shelf. Of course, there's all the books that I could find that I wanted to put in there. So I'm going to probably put magazines. I already put my one magazine there, but as they come in, I can put magazines there so people can read them if they come over. And then I'll probably just put something decorative in the rest of it. So that is my bookshelf. All right. My sheets are washed, so I'm going to throw them in the dryer. Okay, right, let's start the dryer. And then I have a load of wipes that I'm going to get started. bathroom because my friend and I and Steve got ready for a party yesterday so I have all this stuff out and then I just want to just clean everything wipe everything down there's a bunch of clothes over in that corner so I'm gonna go ahead and um, clear all this stuff out there it is all cleared out all the clothing is cleared out so I'm gonna go ahead and scrubbing bubbles it That needed some deep scrubbing, so I just scrubbed the bath, scrubbed the toilet, scrubbed the sink, and uh, yeah, really, really got in there and scrubbed hard. <laughs> so um, I still think I want to bleach the tub at some point, but I'm not going to do that today. And I realized that the cleaning product I do not have at this house is like the mirror window cleaner spray stuff, so that needs to be done at some point too. But I'm just going to go ahead and put everything back, and then I will be done with the bathroom. It is 1 o'clock, and I'm going to have some lunch today. I'm just having um, the rest of the sandwich that I started. So um, I'm just going to hang out here with my buddy and have myself some lunch. It is 1.19 and I just finished my lunch and now I'm going back to cleaning. I love sheets that just come out of the dryer. They're all super warm and awesome. They smell good.
screen. And I swear, Cheetah was going to pounce on the camera. She was sitting there watching it because I guess you can, I mean, you can see what's going on. And she was watching it. And she was like, ooh, something little is moving. I'm going to attack it. And she was like in pounce position. But then she didn't. So that was really good. I was expecting it. Anyway, I am back in the laundry room. Well, laundry closet. I am just going to take out these clothes right here and put them in the dryer. And then start one more load. And that's going to be it for today. is sweep. So the couple places that I want to sweep today are just the stairs and then I'm just going to do a quick sweep of the like living room, dining room, kitchen, like all the downstairs main living areas. And um, I'm just going to do a quick sweep with my broom and this thing and hopefully that will just be fine. It's not that bad. I swept earlier this week. Oh. Guys, it stepped in some tape <laughs> from the book boxes. So yeah, I'm going to run around and sweep a little bit, and then I'll be done with cleaning for today. And then I have a lot more uh, holiday stuff to do. So let's get going. a couple days of only the dining room and the living room so yeah that is Asher hair all up in there so I'm gonna just do the kitchen real quick and uh, then I'll be done sleeping I'm just having a Clementine and taking a break so it's almost two o'clock and I'm done with all my cleaning so I'm just going to go get my phone charger and get get first the video for today on Friday up. I have my Christmas house tour that I finally did that I was planning to do a lot earlier. And then I'm going to just upload a few of, well, all of the stuff that I have for this day in the life. Upload that already so that that is on my computer. And then also charge my computer for, or my phone for a while, just because it is running out of battery. Well, no, it's not, but it's running lower. And I like to have it fully charged at some point. This is a good chance to do it. So I'm just going to go ahead and let it charge up now so it's good for the rest of the day. So I'm just going to sit here. Um, this shouldn't take all that long. It shouldn't take all that long. Um, I just, maybe like half an hour or something, I just need to upload all the videos and then, which might actually take a while because there's a day in the life, which, which is actually a lot of video. So that'll take a little bit and then I need to edit the one, the vlog for today and then I need to... Um, I'm just click it now and get it uploading so it can get started. And then I will upload that and then I'm going to get started on my holiday stuff. I'm sorry I couldn't finish my sentences just then, but that is the plan. I'm going to be here for a little bit. So this is saving. Um, it is 2.34. So I'm just going to leave my phone plugged in just a little bit longer just so that it can finish charging up. And I'm going to go ahead and run out and get the mail and then I'm going to go switch over the laundry so I'm going to be doing that but leave my phone here to charge so I will see you guys after all that Alright, so I did all that I just decided to start one more load also of Steve's dress shirts because I didn't wash any of those in the first two loads so I'm just having some vitamins <laughs> I take I get the um, one a day gummy vitamins for adults. Um, I usually like the sour ones, but they didn't have those. So I got these immunity sport ones because at the time I wasn't feeling too good. So I thought, I don't want to get sick. So <laughs> I'm going to eat those. And um, one second. 
All right, <laughs> I finished eating my, my vitamins. So what I am planning to do is in just a little bit, maybe I'll wait till my um, video is done and I get it uploaded so that that's out of the way. But I want to go outside because, yeah, just have to see if he heard me. It is beautiful outside. I swear it's like 60 degrees or something crazy for December, what is it, December 20th. <laughs> It's insane. It's super sunny and like warm. Like you don't need coat at all. And I really want to go in that for a little bit. So I was thinking take the dog out. <laughs> but I'm going to wait um, and get the video done first. Just because I want to get that out of the way. Alright. I want to do that. Just uploading my vlog really quick. Alright. That video is taking forever to upload. So I'm just going to let it keep running for a little bit. Because I really want to go ahead and go outside. Look how beautiful it is. It's just a super sunny day and really warm. So I really want to enjoy that. It is 3.11 right now. So um, yeah, it's only going to get colder. So I really want to go ahead and do that. So I'm going to take him and we're going to go enjoy the weather a little bit. So we're back home. All right. Hush. And I'm having a glass of water and a mug of coffee. <laughs> so this is my carry around with me mug of coffee of the day because I want to at least get the laundry switched and then I have to run and actually do Christmas stuff or holiday stuff. Alright, so let's get these all out. Ooh. There. That is my one full basket. I have another one. That is the last laundry of the day that is going in the dryer now. So I'm going to go ahead and start wrapping some presents. The first thing I'm going to wrap is just a present for, <laughs> you might be like, why did you get that? It's actually, we're supposed to re-gift something that we already have in our house um, for the holiday party tonight. It's supposed to be something just weird and funny that isn't really like a good gift or anything. Just... Um, I think they said like they want tacky things or just crazy, you know, whatever. So <laughs> we went to another holiday party yesterday where there was like a present swapping game and Steve ended up with this Abraham Lincoln DVD. Um, everyone else got like chocolate and coffee and blankets and all these great things and then he got this Lincoln DVD which Lincoln is a great person but you don't want to sit there on Christmas and watch his documentary mm. and at that it's only part one of the documentary <laughs> so we're gonna I'm gonna wrap that and we're just gonna re-gift it at the party tonight and then I'm going to see as how far I get on my St. Nicholas Day things. We still have tomorrow um, all day because we're only celebrating it at night, so I still have all day to work on that stuff, whatever I don't get done. But I do want to see how much of it I can get done today. That would be nice to get some of that out of the way. So I'm going to go ahead and get started, but first I'm going to wrap the present for tonight, and then I will wrap all those presents and maybe work on my surprise. I'm just going to keep wrapping. Uh, you don't need to <laughs> watch all of it. 
I'm just going to wrap some of the presents for St. Nicholas Day um, just to get some of them wrapped, the ones that I at least have um, my poems written for already and all that. So that's probably this um, tumbler for Steve. Then this is for my dad's surprise, so I'm going to leave that out. But I'm going to wrap the, um, what are these, <laughs> slippers we got, my dad. And this we got Jesse. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap all those presents. All right, so I wrapped, I think, I think all but two of my presents. Because one I still need to write a poem for and the other one is for my surprise. So. I'm going to start working on my surprise. It is 4.09, so I have a little bit of time left. So I am just going to go ahead and show you guys what my idea is and what I'm starting with, and then I'm going to work on it and see what I can put together. All right, so here I just have a large box. This is where our um, TV box came in. So it's just like this, and it's just really rectangular and it opens in the front like this and it's just a big box inside so what my plan is to fill this up with um, I have some packing peanuts um, and otherwise I'll just shred some paper and I'll hide the present in here then I'll close it up and then on the top I'm going to make some kind of game board and I don't know if I told you who who it was for, but it's for my dad, and I got him that manatee little. Uh, it's a little manatee that you put in your in your tea cup, and it you put the tea in it, and it like um, what is that called? I don't know. I don't drink tea, but it it's the kind of thing that you put the tea in, and you put it in the hot water, and it like puts the tea in your water. <laughs> Anyway, I'm describing this really badly, but it's a little tea thing, and it's um, a manatee. So since I had that manatee, I thought I would go with a Florida theme because, you know, manatees live in Florida. <laughs> and it says everyone's favorite Floridian on the uh, little box that, that it comes in, so I thought I'll go with Florida. So I'm going to make a Florida game board, and it's going to be sort of, I guess, like Candyland style. I don't know what style that is, but the kind where uh, you roll the dice and you go however many, and then there's different cards that tell you different things. And he's going to travel through Florida. And then I'm going to set it up that he's one player, and then there's two other players, but then I'm going to make the cards that there's no way the other two players can win. Like, I'm going to have a card that says, you know, like, oh, the blue player... Um, <laughs> gets eaten by a gator or something like that. I don't know. Something that gets that player out so that in the end he has to win. And then when he wins, it says, oh, you won a special Florida prize or something like that. And he, he gets to grab in the grab bag, which is the box part of the game board. So I'm going to try and put that together. I think on the top I'm just going to lay flat a bunch of sheets of paper so that – or maybe I can find something – larger I don't know something that's just flat unless I can peel the stickers off I don't know and then I'm just gonna draw it right on top and then I'm going to borrow some little game pieces from my mom because um, she has a bunch of games and they have dice too so I'm gonna get some uh, some of those and I'm just gonna think of you know animals in Florida and things that are in Florida and um, yeah I'm gonna see how it turns out <laughs> Okay, I just um, put some white printer paper and glued it on here. Uh oh, messing it up already. Oh no. Okay. And um, then I drew the shape of Florida roughly and I made the um, all the spots and I just drew it in pen. So I'm going to trace it out later with marker so it looks better. But this is where the start is going to be and then he's going to walk all around and there's going to be a number on each of these and every time he uh, lands on one he draws the card that has that number on it and then here is where he ends and then here I'm going to make the grab bag hole so that he can reach in and pull out the manatee so yeah that is how I'm working on it right now it is 434 so I'm probably only going to work for like 10 more minutes but I have an idea now and this is a good start so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have like here, kind of where there's a lot of ocean, have like uh, 
the Dolphins beat the game is going to be called Who's Your Favorite Floridian? And then here there's going to be Dolphins and one of the players, there's going to be three players, and the one player is going to uh, get taken out right around here because um, there's going to be a certain number that says, oh, this person thinks that Dolphins are their favorite Floridian and this is going to be where the Dolphins are. And then down here there's going to be the Gators because it's, um, it's the Everglades. And then I'm going to be like, one of them got eaten by a Gator. And then here-ish I'm going to do Mickey Mouse. Somebody thinks Mickey Mouse is their favorite and got lost at Disney World or something. And then here it's going to be like, oh, you... Oh, wait, no, there's only, maybe I'll do four other players, four players. There's three other ones. And then here I'll do, oh, you win, you know, you knew who it was. So why don't you grab in here and then you can pull them out or whatever. So that is the idea that I have going. All right, it is 4.47 and this is what my game board looks like at the moment. With this terrible dolphin. And there's Mickey Mouse. Well, I did my best, right? You know, it's going to have a lot more on it. I'm going to draw a gator down here and then the title on top. And then I'll probably just add a bunch more color, make this look more magical. Um, I don't know, just fill it out with more stuff. But I'm going to stop now. I wanted to switch my camera around. I'm going to stop now because I am going to start getting ready for the Christmas party tonight. Um, we should have a little bit of time, but I wanted to get my hair straightened at least before, um, I know it's really straight, but since I have it up, it's probably going to have like a little bit of a dent in there. So I want to just get my hair fixed up nicely for the party tonight. And then whenever Steve gets home, I'll probably change and, um, do my makeup and all that. But, um, yeah, I'm going to put this away for now. I straightened my hair and now I'm just going to look for what I'm going to wear today. It's not a very fancy Christmas party. Yesterday we went to this really fancy one. We had to go all dressed up, but apparently people are wearing like jeans and sweaters at this one. So, um, I'm just going to find a shirt and then maybe a skirt, maybe some pants. I don't know. We'll see. I think I'll wear this a shirt. It's a good Christmas color. So, <laughs> all right, well, I'm going to pick out what I'm going to wear. Okay, I'm just going to be wearing this uh, red shirt with these black jeggings, and um, I'll be wearing my brown boots. All right, so um, I have a little bit of time before Steve will be home. It is five after five, so I'm going to go ahead and hang up his dress shirts. I'm not going to hang up any of the rest of the laundry, but I don't want these to get wrinkled, so I'm going to go ahead and hang them up right now. That's done. I got them all hung up. All right, it is 5.30 and I'm just going to feed Cheetah Cat. All right, I don't know where Steve is yet. Um, I'm guessing he'll be home at any moment. So I'm just gonna go ahead and get changed into my outfit for tonight, just so that I'm ready to go. No. Shoot your phone. No. Your camera hole. No. That'd be really cool. No. What are you gonna shoot? That phone. Okay, go. Miss. <laughs> Try again. Did it hit it? It moved. Good job. Yeah. 
something down. All right, it is a little after 10 and we just got home from the party. It was pretty fun. We, as you saw, got like a hula skirt and a coconut bra. <laughs> so anyway, um, yeah, we're back now and I'm just gonna take a shower and go to sleep. Oh my gosh, my makeup is everywhere. I've been rubbing my eyes. I'm really tired now. I'm gonna go to bed. I'm just uh, gonna take a shower and go to bed. So, but I'm gonna wrap up this vlog now. So I will see you guys later and, um, I think this is going to be up before Christmas, so happy holidays if you haven't had them already, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.